Oh, God has given me authority to walk all over you. You say, come on. I command, I command you, Satan, in the name of the Lord. Take up your weapon and flee. Oh, oh the Lord has given me authority to walk all over you. You say, come on. I oh, command you, Satan, in the name of the Lord. Oh, Chuck. For the Lord has given me authority oh, to walk all over you. Tell God, I command you, say, Satan, in the name of the Lord, oh, the to turn on your weapon and see. Oh, the For the Lord, Lord has given me authority to walk all over you. Hey, I'm gonna walk, walk over, over you. I wanna walk over you. I'm gonna walk all over you. I'm gonna walk over you. I'm gonna walk over you. I'm gonna walk all over you. Say I command you, you say it in the name of the Lord. Throw down your weapon and flee. For the Lord has given me authority to walk all over you. Walk, walk, walk. I'm gonna walk over you. I'm gonna walk over you. I'm gonna walk all over you. Oh, I'm gonna walk over you. I'm gonna. I'm gonna walk. Over listen, 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 you. listen, listen. Me and the devil, we had a tussle. Yes. But I won. Oh, oh yes, yes, I won. I won. Me yes, and the devil, we, we had a tussle. Won. But I won. Yes, oh, yes, I won. Me and the devil, we can't agree. I hate the devil. He hates me. Me and the devil, we had a tussle. But I won. Oh, yes, I won. Say it. Oh, I command you, you say it. In the name of the Lord. What do you say? Show down your weapon and free. Come on. For the Lord has given me authority. What's that? To walk all over you. Hey, I command you, you say it. In the name of the Lord. Drop, drop. Show down your weapon and free. For the Lord has given me authority. To walk all over you. Repeat after me. Listen, listen. Hey, I got devil under my feet go I got the devil under my feet I said I got the devil under my feet go I got the devil under my feet Listen, the Holy Ghost is holding him down y'all the Holy Ghost is holding him down Lord. the Holy Ghost is holding him down y'all the Holy Ghost is holding me down Lord. the Holy Ghost is holding him down y'all Y'all ain't moving, y'all ain't moving. I said the Holy Ghost is holding him down, y'all. The Holy Ghost is holding him down. Listen, listen. Oh, the Holy Ghost power is moving to strike a magnet. Moving, moving. Oh, the Holy Ghost power is moving to strike a magnet. Yeah, he's moving here. Say it again. Oh, I said the Holy Ghost power is moving just like a magnet. Y'all better help me tonight. Oh, the Holy Ghost power is moving just like a magnet. Tell me what you doing. Hey, I said he's moving, moving over here. there. Moving over there. Just like, like the day of Pentecost. I said the, the Holy, Holy Ghost, Ghost power is moving just like a magnet. Hey, now say move on. I feel this tonight. Listen, here we go now. I said, command you, Satan, in the name of the Lord. Draw down your weapon and flee. For the Lord has given me authority to walk all over you. I command you, Satan, in the name of the Lord. Draw down your weapon and flee. For the Lord has given me authority to walk all over you. Walk, 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 walk. Walk over you. I'm gonna walk over you. I'm gonna walk, walk all over you. Oh, I'm gonna walk over you. I'm gonna walk over you. Oh, I'm gonna walk all over you. Oh, Satan, I'm gonna walk over you. I'm gonna walk 
over you. I'm gonna walk all over you. I'm gonna walk over you. I'm gonna walk over you. I'm gonna walk over you. We're gonna walk all over you. I command you, Satan, in the name of the Lord. Throw down your weapon and flee. For the Lord has given me authority. Walk, 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 I'm gonna run over you. I don't see y'all moving. Some of y'all ain't run moving. All over you. Oh, I'm gonna run over you. Walk over you. Walk over you. Walk all over you. One more time now. I'm gonna walk over you. I'm gonna walk over you. I'm gonna walk all over you. Oh, I'm gonna walk over you. I'm gonna walk over you. I'm gonna walk all over you. Now somebody put him on the run. I said put him on the run. Hallelujah. You ought to praise God till you put him on the run. Shout glory. glory. If you want God to do it, shout glory. Shout glory. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Jesus. Hallelujah. For the Lord has given me authority. To walk all over you. How many gonna walk on the devil? Yes, yes, yes. I said you're gonna walk on yes, the devil. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, I got a few days to take back everything that the enemy thought he was gonna steal. Y'all ain't saying nothing to me. We coming back to take over everything that's been stolen from us. Y'all don't hear what I'm saying tonight. Y'all better praise God like you want it. Praise God like you want it. somebody to be just as crazy as I am and open your mouth and shout yes!
Holy Ghost. Holy Ghost. Ah, Holy Ghost. Ah, yes, Lord. Now, Lord, now, Lord, as you have said, you don't have to news. Move for your people tonight. You told me you would, and so I know that you're here. For the glory of the Lord will come in this house, and you will feel every faculty, everyone sitting here. Reveal yourself tonight. Open the eyes of the little ones. Give them knowledge of your word tonight. Help us to live holy and righteous tonight. Help us to lay aside every weight and every sin that easily beset us. Cause us to decrease as you increase. Come alive tonight. Come alive, I say. Woo! And Satan, your eviction notice has been given. You have no place, no rule, no authority. And the blood of Jesus be against you. You shall hold on the minds of your hearts and people. And we give you praise, honor, and the glory tonight. In Jesus' name. Now somebody clap their hands and tell them thank you. Hallelujah. Uh, well, 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 hallelujah. You may be seated. Blessings upon you. Blessings upon you. Blessings upon you. Blessings upon you. Woo! The first time I came here, the Lord declared unto me, Behold, I set before you an open door that no man can shut. But this time, I got a theme tonight okay (laughs) and the Lord said what does it profit a man to gain the whole world and lose his soul save the children raise your hand children if you're saved don't get scared now you supposed to be a real G you a gangster you you real and I'm real crazy so you better tell me you saved tonight All right. Raise your hand if you got the Holy Ghost. Give it up there. Uh Uh-oh, number gets slim now. You got it? You got it? Tell me you got it. All right, okay. All right. That means we got work to do. All right? I got it when I was 10. So anybody over, put your hand up if you're 10, at least 10. Oh, that's you. You can have it. Put your hand up if you're 10 or over 10. If you're over 10, put your, all right, that's you, that's you. That's you. Okay, I got a few. Oh, yeah, yeah. Jonel, that's my girl over there. She introduced me tonight. Thank you. Appreciate, well, let me go on where I'm going. Appreciate God, amen, for the spirit of the Lord who is my life. That's how I live. In him I move, live, and have my being. He is not the head of my life. He is my life. <laughs> Outside of him, I don't exist. Y'all hear what I said? I don't exist. So, I thank God for him because he is my life. I thank God for the honorable apostle and prophet, Dr. S.T. James. Clap your hands for him. All right. I thank God for my pastor, Pastor and Prophet James Taylor. Clap your hands for him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Clap your hands for the devotion leaders. Come, clap your hands for some good worship. I go a lot of places and sometimes, now listen, I'm being real with y'all. I'm home, right? Y'all told me I was home. Don't tell me you ain't home. I just, you know. Okay. <laughs> okay. All right. So I'm, I, I go a lot of <laughs> I go a lot of places, and a lot of places I go, you have to pump, prime, and beg people to worship God. But when you come to the gospel of Jesus, nobody beg, nobody pumping. You just go on in where He is. You go past the the, the outer courts. You go right on in past the holy of holiness, and you worship God. And I appreciate God for that. Because it lets me know that he does not just show up, but he abides. So y'all appreciate? He abides. His abiding presence. Clap your hands for the abiding. 
See, you don't know what I'm telling you, but what I'm telling you is when God abides here, that means nobody can move him out. Okay, all right, all right, all right. So, thank God for these worship leaders that take the Levites, clap your hands for them, that take you into worship. <laughs> yes. Now, I saved the best for the first. Can't be last because he like Jesus. Beside him, there is no other. Clap your hands for the best pastor on this side of heaven. Pastor, elder, prophet, my advancing son, brother. Yes, elder, praise God. Stanley Bernard, let me hear you. Ow. And he would be less or nothing less without the best thing since sliced bread. Oh, mercy, Lord. I love this lady. My mother loved this lady. We all love this lady. Clap your hands for the one and only first and the last lady. The elect lady. Hat wearing, tongue talking, good looking, sanctified lady. That's right. That's right. And I thank God for my first lady, Sister Rebecca Bush. Clap your hand for her. Let them know y'all like her and you ain't never met her. Clap for her. That's my baby. That's right. Thank God for all of you tonight. I appreciate y'all so much for allowing me to come back and hang out with y'all again. Y'all, we're going to have some good church this week, right? Amen. And now here's all, there's only one thing I want God wants y'all to do. Y'all ready? You want to know what it is? I want you to come this week expecting God to do it. Because you cannot get anything from God if you do not expect him to do it. Now, is that all right? I'm on. Y'all hold on to me. I ain't going to fall. Don't worry. All right? Genesis chapter 1. Yeah. I, I saw you today. You. That's you. I saw you today. You know that? You were in, you were in Bobby's today? You passed right by me and didn't see me. Ah. The eyes of the Lord. <laughs> I mean, walk right past me, didn't see me. I said, I'm not going to say nothing. I'm going to keep walking. I was all right. It was good to see you. She just, I said, oh, she happy. Skipping and smiling. I said, yeah. Yeah. I came to Tortola, and I thank God for everybody. I just thank God for everybody. The man of God. Copy hands for Minister Keith. Copy hands for him. Son of God. Amen. Son of God. Son of God. Appreciate, appreciate God. Thank God for the pastor. Man, I tell you, it's just so good to be here. I told Pastor Bernard when I got here, I'm not talking about the church tonight, I told him when I got here on the boat and I got on the tortola, I said, I felt like my feet were starting to grow roots, you know. <laughs> that means when you come here, you're at home, you know. That means you plant yourself when you come, right? You know, it feels good. Then I get to the hotel, and the lady know me by name, you know. I said, what's my name? She said, oh, um, um, I think I know you. Yeah, you come all the time, you know. So that was the <laughs> it's been a long time. I said, why everybody think they know me, you know? I walked in by, but the lady said, I know you, preacher, man. <laughs> then I got to the hotel, and I start calling names. I said, oh, that's, your name is this. And your, she said, Bob, you crazy. So what you call me? She said, you remember my name? I said, God knows all names if you call them right. <laughs> he knows your name. How many know God knows your name? <laughs> Appreciate God tonight. I'm telling y'all, my joy, my cup runneth over tonight. It runs over. And I appreciate God for what he's about to do. Hallelujah. The word, Genesis chapter 1, verse 1 tonight. Quickened by the Holy Ghost. This is straight out of God tonight because had a different direction, but this is just straight out of God. Y'all okay with that, right? Yeah. This kind of stuff blesses me. I mean, and so the word then declares, in the beginning, God created heaven and the earth. But certain revisions then of the Bible declare, in the beginning, God created the heavens with an S. Because they understood by revelation that there's more than one. More than one 
heavens. Even the Bible said that the heavens are telling the glory of God. Experiencing heavens where God is. But the word started. What's the first three words? Talk to me. What's the first three words? You children better have a Bible. You shouldn't be folding your arm. Where's your Bible? You love Jesus? Find your Bible, God. I came here for you. You better find a Bible. Grow one if you have to. Find you a Bible. That's right, young people. Find you a Bible. I don't, don't, don't be embarrassed now. Don't be embarrassed. You got to have a Bible. Especially if you see me coming, you better have a Bible. And make sure tomorrow you have a Bible. Is that your baby? That's your, that's little you? Oh, look at that little you. Hey. You're a handsome baby. But next time when you're sitting, when, he ha- when you hold him, make sure you're holding a Bible with him. She said, right here. That, that, that means to tell me, uh, I was hiding to make sure you don't try to get me. As long as you got your Bible. Baby and Bible, they go together. All right? In the beginning, God created the heaven and the earth. Right? And so the Bible started with a preposition. In the beginning. Which would suggest that something transpired prior to the preposition. The question then becomes, what happened at the beginning? We understand what Moses saw, that he saw what happened in the beginning, during the time to which God created. But what happened at the beginning was a civilization of people who were not created after the likeness and the image of God. And so the Lord revealed by revelation to me, I saw the beginning. But I saw the beginning at a second time. And when I saw the beginning, bless you, minister singer. Bless you. Bless you. Bless you. Bless you. Bless you. Bless you. When I saw the beginning the second time, he did not show me how he created heaven and earth, but he showed me the body of mankind. And he said, in the beginning, God created the heaven and the earth. But he took me to verse 2 and he said, and the earth was without form and void. He then declared to me, it is these earthen vessels that sit here that were without form and void. But you were not just without form, but you were void of God. Needing redemption, needing salvation. Needing a way of escape from damnation. And so he said, these bodies were without form. So you could not develop a relationship with God because you were void of him. Is that okay tonight? Okay. And you were void of him and darkness was upon your face. In the depths of your spirit. You walked in darkness, you didn't live holy. Didn't do right. Didn't walk like God wanted you to do. You lie, you steal, cheat. Some of you still do it. Stretch us, Lord. And help us. See? You're manipulating. Telling stories. Cheating. Lying to the gas man, lying to the light man, see? Without God, void, empty, and darkness was in you. Because where darkness was, there was no light. There was no light in you. But the thing, something happened one day in your life, sitting at somebody's altar. One day, something happened to you while you were laying on your bed or sitting in a mountain wherever you were, on the mourner's bench or whatever they call it now. You were somewhere praying and the Spirit of the Lord moved. Satasha. The Spirit of the Lord moved upon your face, upon the face of the deep. The Spirit of the Lord moved and he rose in you. And after God rose in you, daughter, he said, and God said, let there be, <laughs> let there be knowledge. Let there be the illumination of my presence. 
I need somebody to stand in my stead. Oh, glory to God. I need somebody to be like me and to act like me. So I say, let there be light. And the Bible said, and God said, let there be light. And there was. It was at this point in time that the Lord said, let there be light. And the glory of the Lord shined upon you. He looked at you. After the spirit of God moved upon the face of the waters. He looked at you. And he brought light into your existence. Taking you out of the dark place. Bringing you into the light of his word. Separating you from light, from darkness. So that who you were you no longer are. Who you were, you no longer are. You do not live after yourself because you were in darkness hidden from the promise. You had no access to God until God gave you some light. The Bible said you ought to show forth the praises of him who called you. He didn't just pull you. He called you out. It's a mighty God when he can call you by your own name and bring you out of darkness into the marvelous light. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And he divided the lights and he called things day, called the first day night, evening and the morning were the first day. Then he spoke, go down in the scripture tonight. And he set things in place. He set a divine order in place. He put things in their proper perspective. He put things in their proper location. He began to move in the spirit of order. Say order. Order. Yes. There's an order to God then. He prepared everything that you would need to sustain your light. (laughs) Can I preach tonight? I feel like preaching so if y'all help me we can go home. All right. He did everything necessary to sustain you as the light. And then spirit of God moves and you go down to verse 26 and God said yes yes daughter yes let who who is us then now y'all you pastor taught that right okay who is us thank you and the word and and who Jehovah oh boy the word and spirit. The Bible, okay, let me make this simple. I'm not going up in there. I'm not going down in there tonight, so stay on top of here, all right? I'm not going down and lose my children, right? The Bible said that God is a what? And they that worship him must worship him. Sanctify them through thy, thy truth. Thy word is, okay, that's truth, right? God is a what? Spirit and, thank you. And the word was made what? Flesh full of grace and thank you. That's why he said let us make man, right? Let us spirit and what? Truth. Which means you cannot be all spirit and have no truth. You can't be all spiritual in the glory of God, in the spirit of God and have no substance. Nothing to hold you together. Y'all ever been around somebody like that? Just speak in tongue all day. Full of God. Got a scripture for everything but walks in nothing. I know folks like that, you know. Got all spirit. Just so high in God. You ain't having a good day. You're mad, you know. Run out of gas in your car. Too hot today, whatever. They want to come here. No, 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 no. Shut up. Then you want to tell somebody, shut up, just knock it off already, right? Shut up! You know, who you all about who who God, girl, God good, shut up. Get real. Next thing you know, they come see you. Girl, pray for me, girl. That devil trying me, boy. He troubled me up. Who the behind the devil is a lie. Speak in tongue. You but no, no, you don't need a tongue, you need a word. 
Y'all hear what I just said? That the Bible said heaven and earth will both pass away. Even Paul said tongues will cease. But you got to have a word in 2017 to sustain you in these trying times. The question becomes, what word do you live by? Because man shall not live by bread alone. Spirit and truth. So then he makes God after the similitude, the likeness of his image. He makes God after his image and after his likeness. And then he gives you something that no other creature has. He gives you dominion over the fish of the sea. Boy, I like some good fish. I just felt the anointing on the salt fish just then. Just pass through here. And over the fowl, those who fly, the rest they on the ground. And them, around here they call them chicken. I see more chickens around here on the ground. I said, anybody own these? <laughs> Y'all gonna mess around and make me go back to the old days and pop. Start plucking feathers. What, what the, go, 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 shut up. You know, too early for that. Right? Fowl up the air. And over the what? Cattle the beef. And over all, what did that leave out? What do you have power over? Over all the what? Earth. And over every creeping thing that creeps on the earth. Like the lizard I saw this morning. Creeping thing. I looked at that thing. I said, the devil is alive. Get out. Get out. Get out. Before you make me scream. Get out. Get out. Get up! I wanted to holler y'all, I'm for real. Get this lizard, he's too big. I ain't used to these big ones. Get off, get off, get out! You know, just freak me out. The blood of Jesus on you, you know. Get out of here. <laughs> Creeping thing. Creeping thing. <laughs> so then God created man, El or Ish, Isha, man in his own image. In, in the image of God created he what? Him, male and female, created he. There is no Shem. God made no Adam for Steve. He made Adam for Eve. Don't forget it. Y'all hear me, children? Don't forget it. Somebody better teach y'all. You hear what I said? Boys, don't kiss boys. Yeah, that's how you're supposed to look. Ugly. Right. Girls, you don't kiss girls. And I got to tell you that because the world system is trying to bring you to it. Every Nickelodeon, every Disney channel, even the news, the new movies are pushing you to agree it's all right. But can I help y'all tonight? That's the reason why Donald Trump made the election. And the world was upset because the Democrats said, no, we want Hillary. But the Lord said. See, some more people don't believe that. See, y'all don't like him. Y'all don't like him because he do some nonsense, you know. Y'all know how, well, okay. You know how stupid he is, but anyway. And y'all, I mean, y'all just catch me outside if you don't like it. How about that, you know? See, you don't like that? Catch me outside, right? He do some stupid stuff. He say anything. He act like, he not diplomatic. He don't, re- re- he don't repent for nothing. Just talk about you. Call you everything. Call you a liar. Call you alternative facts. Fake news. <laughs> talk about your bad boy. I didn't come to preach politics. I'm just telling you what the Lord said. The reason why Donald Trump is in office. 